Hello everyone, I am Imit Alkush. In this video, we will solve one problem in chapter 4. The radius of a ferris wheel in an amusement park is 16.2 meters. The wheel completes 4 turns within 68 seconds about its horizontal axis. If you write this wheel, what will be the magnitude and direction of your centripetal acceleration at the lowest and highest points? Before solving the problem, you should remember that in uniform circular motion, the velocity of the object is always perpendicular to the radius of the circle, and its speed is always constant. Also, the acceleration is always toward the center, that is, centripetal. And its magnitude is found by v squared over r. And speed v is found as 2pr over capital T, where capital T is the period which is calculated by 2pr over v, and it has units of second. Ok, let's solve the problem. We are given R as 16.2 meters. And the well completes 4 turns within 68 seconds. Then, 1 turn is 17 seconds, which is the period. Now, using the formula V equals 2PR over T, we can find the centripetal acceleration. If we put the corresponding numerical values into this equation, we obtain the magnitude of this centripetal acceleration as approximately 2.21 meters per second squared. So, acceleration is always toward the center, that is, it is centripetal. Then, at the lowest point, it is upward. And, at the highest point, the magnitude of acceleration is the same, that is, A equals approximately 2.21 meters per second squared, but its direction is now downward. Ok, that's all about this problem. Thank you for your attention. See you in the next video.